for like the fifth time because he has to be blinded you see it's not permanent I think he does get permanently blind like near the end until he gets his god claw but so he defeats he, he defeats a fender and he passes out he does this little thing where he takes off his cloth they stick to the formula that they've built up especially since this is filler they don't really have too much to go off of then uh he yoga fights this guy named Hagen who's like this ice guy who also happens to be able to make fire because I, the way they I think the what, what they were going for is that uh, he leads his opponents into thinking that he's just an ice guy but he actually has like really deadly fire and uh, this other side chick comes in who also happens to be sort of like Hill was like held as like sister and everyone else's best friend and like in like best friend she's like helping uh the bronze because he's like this isn't what hilda's like i'm Freya, and hilda wasn't mean so you need to help and they're like okay and uh so hyoga defeats hagen then the poopy part happens it's shun's first fight against a guy named me man that's like it's i think i think shun might be the weakest saint which I guess is ironic given his uh, character arc near the end. But I don't know. It was, just, it was really painful to fight, uh, to watch his fight. And I think part of it is because he's not a very offensive saint. Or he's not a very close range saint because you know, he's got a nebula chain. Basically, he was fighting this guy with his harp. And he was all, and she was all like, Nebula chain.